All right, we're back with sports. It won't be long until the baseball and softball seasons for the Mississippi State Bulldogs get underway. Bradley Davis was in Startville for their media day event and has this report. Yeah, that's right. And what you're seeing right now is MSU star outfielder and Jackson Academy grad Dakota Jordan at the plate at Mississippi State scrimmage after both the baseball team and softball team finished up their media days today, getting ready for the 2024 season. And let's keep it with Dakota. Last year's standout freshman entered the portal for a brief period before removing his name to stay with the Bulldogs. Both Jordan and skipper Chris Limonis spoke about his place on the team. There's just a lot of things behind the scenes that happen in that world. I, I think um, I, it really wasn't a ton of conversation. I just think he woke up and said, I'm a Mississippi State Bulldog. For me, it was just like, this is my decision, you know, like I'm um, not going to let anybody take this moment away from me playing in front of the best fans in college baseball. Outside of Jordan, all the focus this season is on the pitching staff after the Bulldogs got rocked in 2023. Both Lamonis and the pitchers say this team has the talent and the confidence under pitching coach Justin Parker's new leadership to show up big time in 2024. Last year we had probably more of a confidence problem than a talent problem. Um, and this year we've got probably more talent and a lot more confidence. And Samantha Ricketts and MSU softball are also trying to take a step forward after following up 2022 Super Regional with a disappointing 2023 campaign. She says this offseason has had a much different feel as she tries to blend the senior personalities with the underclassmen who have yet to make it to that big stage. It's been honestly probably more talking than we've done ever before. A lot of teaching I think is a big part of it and you know, if the expectations are the same, they have to be taught. Others around the league have their doubts. The SEC coaches poll predicts the Bulldogs to finish last in the conference. Players say they aren't seeing the whole picture. A fun environment. It's enjoyable. There's no negativity. There's no, like, like talking behind each other's backs. There's none of that. You know, like, I feel like that's very common in sports. And in any sport, you always get that. But... This year, that's not something that we've really faced. And the road to prove the doubters wrong for both teams starts on February 9th when softball hosts IUPUI at home and followed a week later when baseball opens its season right here at Duty Noble Field against Air Force Academy. Until then, though, reporting in Starkville, I'm Bradley Davis, WAPT Sports. All right, thanks, Bradley. Again, the MSU softball season starts February the 9th while the baseball team gets on a diamond for game one of their season on February the 16th. All right, that's all we have for sports. I'll send it back to you, Megan. All right, Joe, thank you. When we come back, David will have one more check of the forecast.